Well, in this dev diary, we're going to be talking about two more Warframes. We're going to be talking about Excalibur, which is one of the starting Warframes, and Rhino, which is our biggest, most brutish Warframe. The easiest way to start with Excalibur is to say it's the one that people have seen on the wallpaper, oh, on yes. trailers, yep. on basically... He's the poster boy. There's yep. Slash Dash, which is your starter one. Yep. I was with, we were playing around the office. I had no idea who I was playing with. It was all right. new people. And there was like, you could hear the Grenier song, men behind the door, like that. And so they we're waiting, the doors opening up, and then everyone had the same thought at the same time. And all and four of us went and slashed out. Yeah. And there was like eight of yeah, them. Because you're charging in a like second. light speed with your sword. But like everyone just, had that same yeah. kind of anticipation. Like, I know what to do here, which is yeah. awesome. Yeah. And then the power jump, I think, from people's feedback on the YouTube channel right. and stuff. It's like, power drop's my favorite, or at that, those seconds is so cool. It does look really cool. Yeah. Like, leaping up and then following it up with a roll because you have the momentum. Yeah. You just feel really, well, you feel ninja yeah. is yeah. the word. Yeah, I don't use it a ton, but it's awesome when you're going and it's like, okay, here's the exit to this room on your mini map. You're like, oh, I know how to get up there. And yeah. then off you go. Part of the map, so. yeah. Which is awesome. Yeah because you, it goes in a radius, a big bright flash, everyone's like, Aah! like that, and then you can just go in and just start. It's awesome for the melee combat of the game. Yeah. Plus you're, you're casting it like He-Man, you're like, <laughs> and it's like, the, yeah. you know, the light of, of the world is shining, yeah. you know, it's really cool. Yeah. Perception for that one was like, what did that character just do? Yeah. But that it was the rhino, and the yeah. rhino, that's not the only thing he has. This was originally just called Stasis, I think, but the rhino stomp power, oh, where yeah. you're playing against the horde enemy, and like the door opens up and everyone gets murdered. So then, like, okay, let's try that <laughs> again, and you guys got in the elevator, down you go, door opens up, and then suddenly everyone's ready. Jeff like walks them all and stages them all, and then you guys are going in there and slashing them to bits. Oh yeah. Uh, it's the sort of improvisational play and like saving those powers for like just the right moment. Yeah. yeah. In yeah. fact, I was playing with him just this morning, just testing out yeah. uh, mini map changes, and uh, and then he's just watching me play, and I'm just like, and they're just exploding, yeah. exploding, yeah. and that's got like. It's better when they just explode, right? Because they just were ragdolling. And yeah. Like, yes, a billion times better. Because <laughs> yeah. they just turn into like red dust when you, when well, you crush them. It makes sense. It is a rhino charging. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty it's... awesome. The rhino skin one is pretty good too. Oh, yeah. yeah. Popping yep. on and yeah. basically yep. in. I mean, I, I can't help but think of, you know, comic characters I love that you know, power yeah. up. It's such a simple ability that it, you know you know what it is immediately. People around you know what it is, and visually you can really make it look really cool and unique. Uh, and it, it just fits Rhino perfectly. Yep. Yeah.